And uh, one of the greatest rivalries in all of sports, Georgia at Auburn, Deep South's oldest rivalry, Mm -hmm. them Bulldogs, favored by 16 on the road, on the plains, what? Over under Mm. 47, a very low. Uh, Georgia won last year 27 to 6. Who do you like in the matchup? (laughs) Everybody's nervous, you know, (laughs) because Shane ain't picked a a lock of the week yet. Is it going to be this game? Is it going to be Arkansas Miss? My friend, it's going to be this game. Oh, no. Hey, man, I'm telling you. So, when I look at these two ball clubs, you know, I I was not impressed with the game last week. I know Bo Nix played his ass off, but – it was still ugly. I, Auburn has not been the same. I think they just – they got – I don't know what it is. It, it, I've just not felt it. I, I, I felt like Auburn was going somewhere when they were out there at Penn State, and I feel like they left it in Pennsylvania. And they not, yeah. they've not quite found it. They've not had a complete game since that one. Uh, we've got quarterbacks rotating around. I mean, hell, going in last week, we didn't even know who the starting quarterback of this team was. Right. We had a defense that struggled against the run. Now, obviously, obviously, they didn't this last week, but that's because LSU does not have a running game. <laughs> I mean, that mm-hmm. is that is a glaring ob- observation there. But I will tell you who does have a running game, and that is the damn Georgia Bulldogs. <laughs> These guys, for them in Florida, I mean, those probably the two best running teams. Maybe Alabama. You could you could probably swing them in there, but definitely top three in the country. That's just – they didn't have to pass last week. I mean, that's just how good they are. And it wasn't against a, a suck team. It was against Arkansas. So, I don't expect anything different this week. I, I remember this game. I don't know if you remember it from last year when, uh, when Bo went over there and played them Georgia Bulldogs. Mm-hmm. You remember how that – one went right oh yeah he had a rough, rough half, day. i lost a little money that day man and i'm looking <laughs> bo nix was running for his life and guess what brother when you look at what auburn is good at and you look at what they're bad at georgia matches it perfect georgia can run the ball and they can stop you for a moment because they got the biggest damn defensive line in the country mm-hmm I just think this is going to be ugly, and I, I know I know Tiger fans don't want to hear this, but it, it's the truth. Georgia is that good. We've made excuses each week on why Georgia keeps winning and why their defense keeps dominating, and it doesn't matter who's on that field. They just continue to do it. I don't think Auburn's really played anybody. I'm not convinced Penn State's even a good ball club. They had trouble stopping Georgia State. LSU game was was down to the wire. They, they're they fighting for the life. But I don't want them to get – I mean, you're 18th. I think you're further along than, than most people expected coming into this game. But I think you're going to have a rude awakening. I've got lock of the week going here. Georgia Bulldogs, 35, Auburn, 7. Dang, Shane. I Why know. do you hate Auburn? No. <laughs> Lock of, well, you probably say, "Why do I hate Georgia?" Hung Bulldog fans are like, "What the hell?" <laughs> the yeah. Grim Reaper has spoken. <laughs> Believe it or not, Shane, if Auburn scores seven, they'll nearly double how much points Georgia gives up a game. They're they're allowing <laughs> four point six points per game this year. They've wow. allowed one touchdown all season. I mean, I can't argue with anything you're just saying. I mean, I I continue to beat the drum. I think Georgia's the best team in the country. And if you need a team to rely on, they're the only team, and I say that because Alabama looked a little sluggish against Mercer, but they're the Mm -hmm. only team that has suffered no letdown this season. They've just destroyed everybody. Now, will it be a little bit different story on the Plains? Maybe. I mean, that's one of the best home field advantages in all of college football. Bo right. Nix played like a man possessed. He he looked like uh, you know Brett Favre, Johnny Manziel, and uh, <laughs> and Cam Newton <laughs> rolled into one last week. You know what I mean? He yeah. carried them to a win over LSU. Exercised all those demons. Let's not forget Brian Harson Shane. He comes from Boise State, where week in and week out they had to face competition that well maybe not week in and week out, but in the non-conference schedule every year. Teams, they were, you could say, inferior talent, yet they Mm -hmm. found a way to win. So I think there's, you know, there's a lot to like about Auburn heading into this matchup. 
And maybe we've yet to realize what a great coach Brian Harson is. I mean, hell, we sure didn't pick him last week against uh, to, to go on the road and win at LSU, yet he got it done. And I'll tell you what, brother, we're not picking him this week, but maybe <laughs> he'll prove us wrong. But we'll see. I mean, will JT Daniels play in this game? I don't think so. But if he does, that, that should provide a nice boost to the Georgia Bulldogs, even if it is Stetson Bennett, though. And everything you just said, I mean, the defense is just playing out of this world. As long as they can tackle, hell, if LSU could tackle last week, we don't see all these fantastic right. plays from Bo Nix. I mean, it was literally nine or ten missed tackles, that difference in that ball game. Georgia obviously has a lot better defense than LSU, and I think that they'll be able to punish this Auburn defense the way – uh, LSU could not last week on the ground, just like you said. So I'm right there with you. Georgia, I don't have as many points as you because I think it'll be mm -hmm. Stetson Bennett. I got Georgia 27, Auburn 9. Bulldogs still cover. But unfortunately, I, I, man, they're really going to be mad at this one, Shane. I'm locking up the Bulldogs too. So no, oh, no. congratulations, <laughs> Auburn. You're probably going to pull the upset based on those. Miracle. Miracles don't happen on the plains, do they? <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez.